Hello friends, this is Durga again from IT University, a one stop shop to learn all the technologies. So in this video we will start talking about joining the uh, two datasets uh, using PIG. So you can join as many datasets as possible but we will start with uh, two join uh, two datasets and also if you look at uh, the join syntax by clicking on one of these links there are it's uh, probably it is the most complicated operator in pig if you see you can join uh, multiple uh, relations by uh, uh, by using expressions from this and then under the using there are different um, ways to join the data set there is replicated there is queued there is merge there is merge sparse etc and then as we have seen with others we have partition and parallel also where uh, we have covered the parallel in some other video so it's a little bit complicated and also if you go to the certification there are two learning objectives when it comes to joins there is a uh, you should know how to do the inner join of two data sets you should know how to do the outer join of two data sets and then you should also know how to do the replicated joins okay so all these three things you need to be aware of on top of that it's very important for you uh, to understand what is much join at least whether you use it explicitly or not and also there is something called skewed joins which is not uh, that important but uh, you should know what it is and i will try to cover uh, outside the scope of the certification but for the certification you don't need to worry about skewed and uh, merge sparse joins merge joins is implicit um, and uh, uh, we will be you know, looking at replicated joins as well as part of the certification and we will not be talking about partition by and parallel in this video because there is a separate learning objective for it uh, about specifying the number of radio stars for a pig and uh, it is common for almost all the operators so everything will be covered as part of this it's you need to understand theory and uh, other aspects of it and all those things will be covered there so that being said we will see for uh, forward how to do the join between uh, two different data sets using all the combinations and they have provided as part of the syntax if you like this uh, video please click on the like button if you want to provide the feedback please use the comment section of the video and if you are not subscribed to my channel yet please do so you will get to see a lot more content like this over time thank you bye